Is it no surprise that I'm bored out of my mind? So I gone ahead, went on Amazon, and I got a new game to play. Dogs of the Galaxy, by a game development company, Animatopica. Will you own them, or will they own you? <laughs> this is a card game designed with dogs in mind. I gotta say, before opening up this box, this game looks pretty unique. And it seems like they put a lot of thought into building this game. So, this will be the first time I'm gonna see any of the dogs with you guys. And I'm actually happy to show you guys. Opening up the box. Man, that was easy. Ooh. If you were here right now and you could feel this box. It doesn't feel like a cheap box at all. Excellent. So let's reveal the contents. Slowly but surely. Opening the box, I can immediately see the instructions. So let's get that out. There's three different types of cards. There's a common, epic, and legendary. Common cards are worth one point, while epic cards are worth two, with legendary being worth up to three points. To earn each type of card, players do various things. With common cards, think of a, think of a name for the dog. Epics, think of the name of the dog that uses the keyword. For example, Aqua could be Aqua Wolf or Aqua Tron. All this seems very interesting. Legendary, think of the name of the dog that uses the keyword and make a sound <laughs> that this dog could make. For example, <laughs> The dog breeder is the one that draws a card and decides who wins the round. For legendary cards, if one player's dog name is the best, while another player's sound is the best sound, the dog breeder decides whether the sound or name should win the round. To claim victory in a game, a player must announce when he or she achieves 10 points. Dogs of the Galaxy seems like a charades game with a little twist. You are all dogs. Looking at that, the first dog I see is an owl dog. The night is coming, it's time to hunt. And we got a night dog. Anna is in an essential virtue of a knight. A bear dog? Do they technically exist? Wow, this is my territory. He's a very territorial dog. I like that. Aww. How dare they? This dog seems like he needs a lot of help. Uh, can someone help me? I can't swim. Oh, jeez. Is someone gonna help this stupid dog? Help him out already. Oh. Uh, this is a bad time. Really bad. Not what I planned. So, yeah. I guess it's a really bad time. Oh, that's stupid. Is it time to play yet? Who wants to play? I wanna play! Bulldog. This is the coolest card of, of them all. Moo. Don't make him angry. <laughs> Goat dog! Honestly, I'm impressed with all the artwork. The drawings seem to be very simple. They're not so complex. And they seem to be enjoyable for all ages. I should I should be the one to know. Drawing is my passion. And I really do enjoy good artwork. All these dogs are pretty unique in their own special little way. This whole game seems like everyone in the family will have a fun time playing it. If you guys found this card game interesting, leave me a like. Subscribe, comment down below whether you come across this game. Maybe you already have it. If so, I would like to talk about it with you guys down in my Discord. All the available links are available in the description below. 
Again, thank you very much for watching my video. If you found my video informative, just don't forget to slam that like button. I do not make reviews of products that I do not fully agree with. And this is, this is a clear cut example of a product that I really do like. So thanks a lot. Show sure dog bones. That looks like show sure dog home bones Anna. So we got our common dogs down to our epic. Let's look at the legendaries for a bit. Look at the legendaries. They seem like pretty legendary dogs. 